In this video, we'll be discussing how Dolly 2 can be used to start a print-on-demand business which potentially can earn you hundreds if not thousands of dollars a day. We will explain step by step how this can be done. Make sure to watch the video all the way to the end because we will give you an easy extra tip to automatically publish your designs in multiple marketplaces. This makes the potential money you can earn even higher. First up, what is Dolly 2? Dolly 2 is a text-based image generation program developed by OpenAI. It can be used to generate unique and high-quality designs for products such as t-shirts, phone cases, mugs, and even paintings. This can all be done based on just a text description. This makes it an ideal tool for creating designs for a wide range of products and services. It is especially useful for starting a print-on-demand business. Dolly is free to use up to $18 of credits. An image only costs a few cents each, so this method is almost completely free to do. So first up, we want to create an account at Dolly. This can easily be done on the website, which we will show on screen right now. A link will be in the description as well. Now once you have created an account, the next step is quite easy. You want to fill in anything you want to generate into the field. For this example, we will generate a pink cow in cartoon style. So let's search for that query and see what comes up. In the meantime, Dolly will show you some examples on screen, which you can see right now. Once the page is loaded, you can see the tool generated four different styles for this image. Each of them looks really good. So let's click on the first one and click on variations. This will generate similar images in the same style as the images you selected. Once everything is loaded, you can see the four new generated images. For this example, I actually don't like these images. They are nicely generated, but I prefer something more alive. So why not let Dolly do the work for us? To do this, we can click on the button Surprise Me. This will generate a random query. From there, you want to click on Generate. Once the page is loaded, you will see some new designs. I actually like these new designs a lot better than the previous ones. So let's click on the first one and click on this icon. This will download the image. You can repeat this process and download lots of images you like for a t-shirt, painting, mug design. Once you have enough pictures, we will go to the next step. Also, don't worry. Since all the images are generated, you won't get any copyright issues. Next up, you want to go to Printify. A link to the website will be in our description. You want to sign up and create an account. Once you have created your account, you want to click on Design Product. From there, you can choose a product you want to sell. There are more options than only these Valentine's Day picks, but for this example, we will just choose the first shirt. Once the page is loaded, you want to scroll down. There you will see the print on demand providers you want to choose. We suggest to choose based on the location you want to sell and the price. In this example, we will choose the first option. From there, you want to add your design which you have saved earlier to your computer. You could this by click clicking on my device and selecting the image. Once the image is imported, you want to choose the colors you want to sell the products in. In our example, we will select all the colors that are available. Make sure to only select colors that fit in with your design. Then go on and click on the Save Product button. From there, you want to select the color t-shirt and mock-up design you want for the t-shirt. You can click on the image on the left to zoom in and check out how the mock-up looks. Once everything looks like you want it to, you want to scroll down and fill in a good title or description for your design. Of course, we will not write something ourselves. We will just let ChatGPT do it for us. To do this, you want to go to the ChatGPT website. A link will be in the description. From there, you want to ask ChatGPT a question similar to the prompt which we'll show on screen right now. Now ChatGPT will do the magic and create a description for you. Now you want to copy the generated description and add it to the Printify product. After that, you will need a title for the video. You can ask ChatGPT the prompt which shows on screen right now to generate a title. Then go back to Printify and fill in the title. Now scroll down and edit the prices. 
You can do this by filling in at shirt price or by editing the profit you want to earn in dollars or percentage. Please note the platform you will sell on takes 6.5% of the selling price, so make sure your margin is not too low. Once you have done that, you want to scroll down and click on Connect Store. Now you will be redirected to a page. Here you can create a new store for your products or click on the store that is already there. In this example, we will click on Connect. Now you will be redirected to a page where you can connect your store to Shopify, Walmart, Etsy, and much more option. In this example, we will choose Etsy. If you don't have an account yet, you want to go to the website of Etsy, we will put a link in the description. Once you have created an account, you want to follow all the steps, including adding your first fake listing in order to get access to your full account. Once that is done, you want to go back and click on the connect button and log into your Etsy account from Printify. Once you are logged in, you want to scroll down and click on the grant access button. Now wait for your store to connect to Etsy. Once your store is connected, you want to go to My Products and Printify. There you will see your new product, which is not yet published. Now click on the three dots and click on the Publish option. It might take a minute, but now Printify will push the product listing to Etsy. Once the status button shows Publish, we want to see the product on Etsy. We can do this by clicking on the three dots and then clicking on See in Store. Now you are all done, your t-shirt is online and you can start selling. Please note, each published listing will cost you 20 cents for up to four months or until the listing is sold out. For each sale, Etsy will charge you 6.5%. Now to offer your product even wider, you can go back to Printify and click on the right corner on your shop. There you can click on Manage My Stores. From there, you can add even more channels to sell your products on. eBay and Wix can be used for free. If you, however, want a professional web shop, we recommend you to use Shopify or WooCommerce. And that's it for today. We just scratched the surface of what's possible with Doll E and Print on Demand. We've shown you how easy it is to create unique designs for your products and how you can publish your design. But there's so much more to learn about starting and growing a successful print on demand business using Doll E. To learn more about growing your store, optimizing listings, and how to make money online, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We'll be sharing tips and strategies to help you take your business to the next level or to start a business from nothing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you in the next one.